G'day, I'm Tony Fountain and welcome to Bougainvillea. You know, as a country boy, there's two things I like in life, there's quality and simplicity. And I guess if you're watching this video, you're either my generation looking to make a sea change or your parents are in that particular category. It's all here, you're in a prime part of Sydney real estate, 50 yards up the road, you've got military road, you've got the shops here in neutral, but look, it's all there. Let's have a look and we'll show you through. Come on, let's go. Morning, Sue. Morning. That's the friendly face you meet when you first come into this beautiful area here in the foyer. You know, when you go through a lot of establishment of businesses, you invariably see somewhere on a wall a thumping great big mission statement that says what the company or the outfit's all meant to be about. Well, here at Bougainvillea, it's very simple. It's about one word, which is care. And the care extends to you or your family. The care staff, I cannot fault. It's all done and they all seem to know your needs. They come and help make the bed. We have our, all our washing done clean the place, I mean, what more could you want? The doctor comes in once a month. The, uh, the staff are trained in first aid. I had a health problem. I had to call at two o'clock in the morning. The good thing about it was that someone was here that I could press a button and, uh, and she could come and look after me. Nothing's too much trouble. When I'm showing prospective purchases around the village, they often comment on how friendly people are in the village and how welcome how welcoming they're, they're made to feel. I knew it was going to be lovely because when I looked round I was enchanted that everybody has been so kind and friendly. I'm convinced this is because the business is family run, it's not part of a chain or a group or a corporate so it has that human element to it. For any but a retirement village management is important and we have the best here because they're friendly, we're not a number. And the people are very friendly. They make men feel at home. You can be as independent as you like or you can be as looked after as you like. It's entirely up to you. So let's go for a wander through. We'll show you all the facilities and I think you'll agree that Bougainvillea should certainly be on your list. You know, I reckon the only problem with living in Bougainvillea is you're going to spend all your time at that window looking out at the gardens and down in the dining room or in the heated swimming pool or the spa or gymnasium. There's just so much to do in this, this complex. There's so many wonderful things that you can do here with so many wonderful people. We have a beautiful lady here. She's just been up to Darwin and across to swim with the crocodiles and up with the helicopters. That's only a couple of weeks ago. And she's 99. My family thought I needed to be, needed to be here because I've had a stroke. And everybody kept saying, hello, hello, hello. And I went, oh my God, they're lovely. I feel safe which is very important when you get older. I came here because I was sick of having loud music every second night where I lived and the, and the unit next door was very, very noisy. The company is great because I've been living on my own for a long while. I'm very, very glad I came here because it's very sociable. Just to eat with other people and sit and talk with other people is great. And there's meals provided you can Eat, eat, you need never stir out of the place, actually. Well, folks, as you can see, looking at me, my man has got a good tooth. I like a good meal. And this is the engine room of this establishment. Chris and David here doing a fantastic job preparing the meals. All the meals were prepared here on site. Three courses at night and two courses at lunchtime and your plate of cereal in the morning. That's why everybody stays here and lives and lives and lives and lives. You can, with your meals here, you can either have them in the dining room, you can take them away, or they can be delivered to your room. But one thing you can be assured of, it is all top tucker, prepared by people who really know what they're doing. Fantastic. I can have lunch here as well. Oh, I join in activities when I can. If there's, we'd have a regular bus outing, I think I join them all when I can. I go out sometimes. I just 
they'd have a wonderful, wonderful life here. Neutral Bay, five minutes walk to the shops. We like to go out and just walk across the road to the supermarket and up the road to the doctor. Good bookshop for Robin, which is very important. My main criterion was good public transport to the city because I love going to the Sydney Opera House. I go in 34 times a year, so I'm an opera house junkie. It only takes three minutes to walk down to the bus that takes you into the city. You get that same bus nearby and that takes you down to the ferries. Sydney ferries are a delightful way to travel, wonderful transport. And I play cards. We have exercise once a week, which is very good and very innovating and really feel pretty good and young after those exercises. sporting things which I do, shuffleboard, snooker, bingo, you meet people every week, it's a different group, I love it. We play to win, but we don't make it too serious and we have a bit of fun. Then after snooker on Saturday afternoon we come in here for happy hour. Here we are in one of the bigger one bedroom apartments here but there's just a ton of space and of course you've got these magical views. Let's go and have a look at the bedroom and you'll see what I mean about design properly. Hey, how good is this? Tell you what, if your name was Nebuchadnezzar, you'd be happy here. It's like the Hanging Gardens of Babylon. Beautiful. And this is the inside of the building. So come with me now and we'll have a look and show you the real garden outside. Morning, ladies. Morning. Look at this. Winter's day, absolute sun trap in here. Magnificent. Just a beautiful area. Quiet, peaceful. Look at this, the koi fish in there. You've got all sorts of plants. Just, oh. Now look, it doesn't matter whether you're in a unit with a balcony or you're on a ground floor unit like Mary and Robin over here. Pull into this. We looked at all sorts of places up and down the peninsula and we, we ended up here. We were lucky enough to get this little garden unit. So we've got this garden, it's quiet, we've got all we could possibly want here. And life is much, much easier as a result. Terrific. Look at this, Elaine and Adrian here in the heated pool, winter's day, fountain running, got a couple over here reading their books, enjoying life, doesn't get any better than this, I can tell you. We've got over here the spa bath. Folks, this is what Bougainville is all about, classy living, healthy body and soul. So let's go, I'll show you a little bit more. Now, I don't know about you, but I reckon one of the most relaxing things in life is actually reading a good book. And, here in the library at Bougainville, you would have to have some very contented reading indeed because of not only have you got these beautiful Chesterfield lounges to be sitting on, but you've also got a fantastic collection of books ranging from history right through a whole heap of subjects. So when you add that to the balance of what's here in Bougainville, you've got a hairdresser that comes in once a week. You've got a fantastic outdoor entertainment and barbecue area where they tell me, and I'm not meant to know, but they tell me the Melbourne Cup day here is a day to behold. Apparently I involved, get involved in dancing and uh, I have a nice um, friend who dances with me sometimes and that's Anna. I think she's taken over from Ingrid actually. So at Christmas time we have a bit of fun, that's all. We have a, f a great time on Saturday night. It's like a party, if you could see our table, it's full of bottles, we're not drunks. <laughs> Uh, there's just a whole heap of activities on here at Bougainvillea and to show you just how versatile Bougainvillea is, here we are in the library and we've got the group over here playing bowls. The residence committee asked the management if we could have indoor bowls. We have many other activities but this was one that we didn't have. So about four months ago we started indoor bowls and we're very pleased, we've got a happy group and we really have a good time. In the Bay Club Resort then, in summary then, what we've got, we've got 138 apartments in total. We've got 37 of those are serviced. The one bedrooms apartment, we've got en suite bathrooms, living room, uh, dining room, kitchenette, etc. The serviced apartments, they come with a package which includes the cleaning, 
laundry and meals, breakfast is supplied to your room. Uh, there's a two course lunch, three course dinner, Sundays three course lunch, two course dinner. I did look at a self care one but I have an eye problem so I decided to go into the service department and I can say it is one of the best things I ever did. It was important for me to buy my own strata title unit, uh, which I could do here, which made me feel very secure. And 101 of them are independent or flexi. Uh, they range from studio to uh, one bedrooms plus a study, two bedrooms with a balcony or enclosed balcony. And the term flexi is used because the resident can make use of the same surfaces as the service departments on a user pays basis. So there's a really good range and a mix with the, with the properties. As I said right at the start, if you're my age, you're older, your parents, and you're looking to have them move into a facility that's absolutely tops in every description of the word, then this is the one to be in. It's really nice to feel like you're working in a valuable environment that's um, you're really providing something um, valuable to the community. I just they have a wonderful, wonderful life here. I just, just love being here. It's a very, very nice place to live. I've been looking around trying to find something wrong with wrong with a place, but I can't. I've loved it from the minute I've walked in. I think Bougainvillea tick, ticks all the boxes. It's like living in a five-star hotel. I love it and it's been really, really good for me. But it's the happiest place you could ever come to. And I didn't think I would be happy, but I am happy. <laughs> <laughs> Initially, we were reluctant to come. A few months ago, Robin said to me, I am glad we came. <laughs> I'm very happy, thank you. 27 years since we welcomed our very first residents to Bougainvillea. I've been here 21 years next Monday. I've been here nearly five years. I've been here just over four years. I saw it 27 years ago when it was first opened, and so I knew when anything happened to me, to stop me driving, etc., I would come here. We've been here two years and three months. Nearly five years, I've been told. I've been here seven years. Ten days. And I'm sure I'm going to be very happy here. And I congratulate Carol and her family on the wonderful things that they have done for this place. We aim to be very personal. We aim to make every resident be able to feel at home and today it's been absolutely lovely to hear what the residents say about their lifestyle, what they say about our staff. It's really good to hear. Why don't you seriously consider coming to join us?